So it's the holiday season, and uh, this past Saturday was the Saturday before Christmas. And my son and my husband and I decided that we were going to go down to the Tanger Outlet Mall. So I thought we were absolutely, totally crazy going down there um, the Saturday before Christmas. But it wasn't too bad. We had a ton of fun. And I really wanted to wear this style that I have not reviewed yet. Uh, so I took it out and about. I had an absolute blast wearing this style, Mia by Tressalore. And this one is in the color Mimosa HL. Now Mimosa HL is a, it's, it has a medium to light auburn in there. You'll find some light caramel shades. And then it's very heavily highlighted with a pale ash blonde. And that pale ash blonde is really chunky right around the face. The color distribution on this particular style is amazing. I love the chunkier highlights and then framing the face with the lighter ones. It just, it's so beautiful. Now all of that is on a medium brown root as well. And then while I'm up here, Mia has a full lace front and a left monofilament side part. Let's take a look. So that lace front runs temple to temple. The knots are very fine and they do run that highlight up to the lace front giving it a nice natural look. And you can definitely see through to the illusion of scalp all the way back to the crown along that monofilament part there. So let's take a look at the specs. So right around the face, there's an eight inch layer. And again, that's kind of curly, but it does nicely frame the face. This is very manageable around the face. In the back then, you'll find an 11 inch nape and like, or an 11 inch crown and like a six inch nape or so. And that's gonna yield a total length of about 14 to 15 inches from the crown to the tip. Mia weighs about 2.4 ounces, so it's really, really lightweight and very easy to wear. I love this curl pattern on Mia. It's just a slightly broken curl, kind of tousled, a little bit messy. And the fibers are super baby fine more of the drier feeling to the touch. Mia has a ton of permatease. Uh, lots of permatease here on the top around that monofilament there at the crown. Heaviest at the back and the nape, which is pretty typical for a curly style like this. Now I do have another Mia that I'm going to show you in the color Silky Sand. And uh, I have worn this one quite a bit. So let's, I'll go ahead and change. I'll be right back. You can see some differences among the cis the same style um, and this particular one uh, was not quite as beautiful as the Mimosa HL when it first came out of the box. I really kind of had to work on it a little bit to train the bangs to go back. The curl pattern was slightly different. So here's an inside look at the cap and this is very very important to note that this cap runs large. Um, if, if I've taught you anything on this review, I want you to know the cap runs large. There's your temple to temple lace front. It does go back into that ear tab. It's a solid velvet ear tab. Seamlessly back into a very long monofilament part with a nice wide parting space. And there's a, an, a velvet extended nape with Velcro adjusters. And I do have to crisscross those adjusters to get a nice fit for my petite average circumference. But I'm okay with the fact that this is large. Even though I struggle to get a good secure fit for a petite average circumference, there are some things I can do. I can uh, crisscross the adjusters. I can use some maybe some adhesive or some, some uh, walker tape or something along the front of the cap just to keep it secure if I feel like it's going to roll around. I really like this style so much that I'm willing to make those accommodations for it. I'm gonna go ahead and splice in some clips now of uh, me out and about with my family in my Mia by Tressalore in the color Mimosa HL. Have a wonderful day. See you next time on Taz's Wig Closet. It's going to be a fun day. Uh, just me, Bill, Colton. I am wearing Mia by Tressalore in the color Mimosa HL. Beautiful hair. So we're going to see what it looks like out and about.
have to have my Starbucks. I love their flat white. No sugar, but lots of cream. So my son is inside of the Banana Republic right now. It's been so nice having him home. So you finding anything? So he must have found something then if he's in the fitting room. Yep. Sure? We found a few things, well, some chinos. I love these sure. sweaters right here. Little v-neck. It smells good in here. My son's not crazy about being filmed, so this is kind of some rare footage here as he circles the island of sweaters. Lots of walking. My son still has a limp uh, from the knee and the broken hip from the accident.